In this video, we will show you how to navigate on a Garmin Avionics Plus chart with a compatible Garmin chart plotter. First, go to Navigation Chart. Tap the position you want to go. Select Auto Guidance. The chart plotter will use your vessel's information and chart data to create the best route to your destination. You may see some warnings on your route. Select Hazard Review to check them. A striped line means the route is shallower than the safety depth you set. Or there is a bridge lower than the safety height you set. A gray line means there are land or other unknown obstacles so that the chart plotter cannot calculate the route. If you want to edit the route, select Adjust Path. Tap on the path to add a point. Then, drag the point to the position you want the route to pass. Repeat the steps to add more points. Then, start navigation. If you are off route, you will see an orange line. Follow this path to return to the auto guidance route. To set the preferences of the auto guidance, go to the home screen. Select settings. Preferences. Navigation. Auto guidance. Select preferred depth to set the minimum water depth for your boat. Select Vertical Clearance to set the minimum height of a bridge or obstacle that your boat can safely travel under. Select Shoreline Distance to set how close to the shore you want the Auto Guidance Path to be placed. There are two other ways to navigate. Go To and Route To. Go To creates a straight line route to the destination. It may run over land or other obstacles. If you are off route, you will see a corrected route. Follow this thin line to go directly to the destination. Route 2 is similar to Go To but allows you to add turns into the route. Drag to adjust the turning point. Select Add Turn to add another turning point. Drag again. The turning points are added from the destination to your boat. Select Done to start navigating. If you are off route, you will see an orange line. Follow this path to return to the route. To stop navigation, just select this icon. Or select Options. Navigation Options. Stop Navigation. Lastly, besides directly select your destination on the chart, you can also search saved locations. Select Where To. You can navigate to your saved locations or built-in locations. To search for them, select Services. Search by name. Select your destination and start navigating. And that's it. Thanks for watching.